Uh, hello everybody welcome to Kennedy's AG life today we are going to do a dollhouse tour we have never done a dollhouse tour before um, and we got our dollhouse in August of this year excuse me <laughs> last year August 2019 um, and we had so many things and still have so many things that um, we just needed a dollhouse to like get it all situated so here we go all right, we will start off in the kitchen. Um, I have the My Dolls dollhouse, and this dollhouse has funky wallpaper. You can kind of see on the bottom um, where contact paper didn't cover. But we just did different styles of contact paper in this room. So in the room, we'll start on the left here. We have, it's kind of like a seasoning shelf rack that came with, it was in the box packaging for the Our Generation Kitchen. Um, and Kennedy just thought to hang it up here and it actually was really good. We also have the American Girl Gourmet Kitchen, but I just swapped it out um, for a different look, something more spring-like. Here's the recipe box for, here's the recipe box for, from the, um, American Girl Kitchen. On top here is flour and sugar from American Girl Kitchen and all of these boxes of food are from American Girl Gourmet Kitchen. This little timer is from the Christmas set, the Christmas cookie set from this year. And then we have salt and pepper from the American Girl Gourmet Kitchen. Pots and pans. Like there's some cookies hiding in the in there also from the gourmet kitchen we have the crock pot on top of the refrigerator and that's from the crock pot set and then if we open the refrigerator oh, I knew that was gonna happen um, we have kind of like a mismatch I'm in the process of reorganizing all of our food um, and so here we just have some eggs drinks the 7-up um, Christmas party punch set from Mary Ellen's collection. Um, we have some berries on the bottom here. And then, close that. The freezer section, just kind of a mishmash of things. On the corner here is the um, cooler set from a couple summers ago. And this is dog and food and water from our generation. The table is set sort of for Valentine's Day. So we have the hot and fresh pizza. It was from a sleepover set a few years ago. And the pizza is in the shape of a heart. So that would be cute for Valentine's Day. Pink plates, pink napkins, pink glasses, um, soda or sparkling water. Grace's set her macaroons cell phone and then on the chair is a cheer bag and Joss's purse. Um, this table is also American Girl. We have this table and then we have the Melody table but this one seems to go better with our current theme. So that is our kitchen. dollhouse is the living room we'll start on the corner here on the side this is the fireplace it was like really big a couple years ago with our generation and it's meant for Christmas time so there's like the whole set it has like stockings and candles and a Christmas tree but we just took all of that off after Christmas we have the American Girl couch this is from a few years ago as well and we have, oops, that's the couch. We also have this blanket. It's from the purple pullout chair that turns into a bed. And then there's number 82, we call her Hannah. And 
Girl of the Year 2018 Luciana sitting on the couch. They kind of look like sisters. Um, next we have just a little side table. So I feel like every living room needs a side table. So this is from Mary Ellen's collection. You have the lamp that actually turns on. It's really big too, like if you compare it. Really oversized. Got that light, I don't know if you can see it. It's getting kind of dim. But that's our lamp, our side table. And on here we just have games. Um, Uno is from a sleepover set. The checkers and Pictionary are both from the game, the fun and game set, the newest one. And then this little basket is from the hotel set. And then we have the entertainment center, which is also a few years old. I want to say like 2016-ish. And we just have um, the little boxes on the bottom. Surprisingly, we still have things. Um, we have Dance and Blocks. This is from the Xbox set, which I have in the upstairs portion. And we still managed to keep one of the 3D glasses. These are like really flimsy paper. So the fact that we still have one is pretty good. It's been about four years since we've had this. Um, what else? In this one, we have another game. And here's what came with the set, the karaoke DVD and the Grace DVD. And there's something else in this box. Um, oh, this is from Gabriella's collection. Nice. It's from her cupcake set. Then on the bottom, we have some books that the girls would be reading. So we have the Sage mini book, we have just a regular book to write in, like a composition book, geography for studying, and then of course Harry Potter, because I'm a Potterhead, so everybody has to be a Potterhead. So those go there, and I'm trying to think what I have in here. Oh, I do have some sneaky stuff in here. Oh, this is just a dog outfit that we got from our generation, and guaranteed Reagan put that there. She's the youngest and she loves the pets. So that's our one. All right, the next room is the bathroom. The bathroom used to be upstairs, but, and we used to have two bedrooms, but we moved it down because some of our floors were sinking. Um, we did some tinkering with it today, and hopefully they're a little bit more stable. Um, but we also have a lot of stuff in here, so I know why they're sinking, I just want it to stop. But um, I don't have any dolls in this room, so like every good bathroom, we have the vanity. And we have just toothbrushes, toothpaste, and these are just from various sets. I think they're from mostly our generation. And then underneath the sink, we just have a travel bag, more toothpaste, dental floss, shampoo, toothbrush, sunscreen, the essentials. Um, and th this is all from my life ads from Walmart, this vanity, this toilet, and this shower, which we don't really have anything, anything much in there. This is shampoo and the conditioner that it came with. And I think it came with a loofah too, but I don't know where that is anymore. And then we have the Our Generation bathtub, which I like saw this everywhere and really wanted it for the dollhouse. It is um, like a spa style and it does make noises which is really cool and it came with lots of little accessories like your foot soap on the rope, foot scrubber, um, loofah, back scrubber, bath salts, all of the things. So that is really cute and then it also came with this little rug that would just leave by the bathtub. 
So that is the bathroom. Probably the most plain part of our dollhouse, but it serves its purpose. Joss's bedroom. We only have one bedroom right now because like I said the floors were sinking and so we just had to sacrifice one of the rooms and right now this is Joss's room and most of the things stay the same just whatever's on the desk changes depending on whose room it is. So right now Joss is the girl of the year. This is her room and space. So here's Joss and she's just wearing one of the older cheerleading outfits. I think this one's actually nicer than the one in her collection but it is what it is. So she's wearing that. This bed is from our generation. We've had that for a while. They still have this bed, but I often see it in that brassy, like rose gold color. A couple of dogs, as we have quite a few of the pets. This desk is from My Life As, really big a couple years ago as well. Has the blue chair, and her jacket is on. Oh, chair is slipping. Her jacket's on the back of it. Um, in her room she also has Blair's tote bag. I just thought this was so cute when it came out with all of the um, clipboards and notebooks so it just stays in there. She has a laptop. This is Gabriella's laptop that she's using. Homework stuff like a times table. Um, here's another book, Slumber Wonders. Notepad. The Fuji camera which is just so cute. This comes in the birthday set. Like, adorbs. So, love that. And then her case for her hearing aids right there. Lamp, pencil boxes. This has all of the, oops, can I open it? Just one hand without making a mess. All of these pencils that used to come with all of the school supply sets back in the day. Um, this is a pencil set from, or a box from our generation. It has like math items in there. And then just some decorations. I think the cacti are from an Our Generation set. Harry Potter Time Turner sticker book. I got it with a replica Time Turner. And then there's a cat picture from Gabriella's collection. I don't think I have much in here. But I don't want anything to fall. Oh, mittens, nice. And a tape dispenser. And then the drawers are like full of everything <laughs> so that is Joss's room and she has the chevron pattern I forgot to mention in the living room and the bathroom I put in the marble pattern which ended up being my favorite but I had so many different rules I just changed it up for each room Last but not least is the top portion of the dollhouse. I recently changed this like today. It was always the laundry area and at one point it was also the bathroom but it started sinking the floors. So then I decided today that I was going to make it like a rec room space. So I kind of pulled all of the things we had that were kind of packed away and made it a rec room space. So here's Logan hanging out with his Xbox. He's got his controller, Xbox, um, this checkerboard table goes with the checkers from downstairs. Um, that little chair is from My Life As. Tray and cookies are from Sleepover Set. I don't think they sell it anymore. And then the popcorn is from the Camp Out Set. Then I use the hotel cabinet just like as a place to set things pizza because everybody needs pizza when they are wrecking out and then just American Girl bag for decoration. I put a football up here. This is also from the camping set um, and I put file cabinets 
because it was part of a set and so it was cute. And then I put sort of like a dance area over here with Gabriella's dance bar and her dance box. So I love it. Um, I did put this is like circular wallpaper. Um, and I think of all of the rooms, this paper turned out the best. I think I was the most patient with it. But contact paper is very tricky to do. I should have just painted it. For lighting, I just use these push button lights. I got some on Amazon and some at Costco. And the Costco ones change color. And um, the Amazon ones just stay white. I think are these all color ones up here. Oh, here we go. And they each take three AAA batteries, so when it's time to change batteries, it's a big ordeal. And they all come with remotes. And I'm looking for those Costco lights that kind of tape around and plug into the wall. That would be great. But that is the current dollhouse. Thanks so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. Have a great day.